The Shibuya incident to normal people gotta be so crazy because what in the blue hell happened that night? How is this explained to normal people? A nuke? What type of nuke would leave buildings sliced in half like that? Then you go into the subways and it's like a completely different event went on down there compared to up there. You go into the one random bathroom, it looks like a fucking war happened in there. Then you look down to the left, there's a blood puddle like there was a body there, and then a body with no head. And we can't forget the obvious, dead bodies all over the place. Then we got the eyewitnesses because people have definitely saw something. They may not be able to see like the jujitsu shit, but they can still see the people. So if you're just a normal guy, you try to escape, go up ground. You see a pink haired teenager with another teenager who looks like he's on steroids fighting nothing. Not to mention there's one consistently clapping and switching places with the other one. And that's as far as I can explain because I haven't finished the season yet. But just off of that, let's say Shibuya just ended right there. Giant craters, sliced up buildings, dead bodies, one torn up bathroom, teleporting teenagers. None of that can be explained properly. What happened in Shibuya? If I'm a Japanese resident, I'm moving from Japan in general. I'm never going to Shibuya. I'm never going to Japan. I'm moving to like um, France, some nice place. And even then you can never be sure because you don't know what happened in Shibuya.